So following this developing story out of Winchester, a man accused of brutally killing a young woman inside the public library there is expected in court tomorrow. This is investigators look for a motive. Right now it's unclear if the suspect and the victim knew each other. Now this morning we're learning more about the suspect. WBZ's Lisa Greshi hearing from neighbors and Lisa, they're saying this may have been a case where there were some warning signs. That's right, Nick, and it's a sad morning here in Winchester. People are starting to come and drop off little stuffed animals and flowers in front of the library, and you see the entrance of the library is still closed off with crime scene tape. I'm shocked. I would never have expected this to happen. A brutal murder at the Winchester Public Library. It was about 10.30 in the morning Saturday. Police say a 22-year-old woman from the town was suddenly and viciously attacked and stabbed to death by the suspect, identified as 23-year-old Jeffrey Yao, also of Winchester. The young woman was in the library, seated at a table in one of the reading rooms, apparently studying or doing some work. Mr. Yao began striking her with what we now know to be a appears to be a hunting knife with approximately a 10-inch blade. She suffered a number of slash and stab wounds. And the chaos that followed a 77-year-old man who tried to intervene was also stabbed and wounded. People inside and outside the library were horrified. There was a, a woman taken out, uh, and uh, I didn't get close to her, but it appeared that she had some injury to the uh, shoulder. As far as a motive goes, police aren't saying if Yao knew the victim or not. The suspect lived with his parents a few miles away. Neighbors say he appears to have mental issues. He kind of knew this kid was a ticking time bomb. Last August, he threw a potted, he tried to throw a potted plant the through house. the window over there, um, and... They took, the, he ran from the police. Yeah, I was expected to be arraigned tomorrow morning sometime. And people are really starting to come out. Like I said, one woman came out in the rain to drop off a little stuffed animal. And we asked if she knew the victim. And she said, we all do. Reporting live here in Winchester, Lisa Greshi, WBZ This Morning.